Now to this week's unsolved murder file. He was shot and killed more than seven years ago at an intersection on the south side of Corpus Christi. And no one has ever been arrested or charged. And tonight our best Virgil tells us why this case has been so difficult to solve. A cross now sits here at the intersection of Rodfield and Slough Road, where Lozano was shot multiple times. The crime happening in broad daylight. A lot of things have changed at this intersection over the past seven years, but one thing remains the same. The constant question, what led to the murder of Henry Lozano III? The day was August 17, 2010. Lozano, the owner of a local cement company, was leaving home and was on his way to work when the shots rang out. I was basically killed as he came up to a stop sign. Described as an avid Longhorn fan and someone who had a passion for the great outdoors. The 49-year-old was also a family man. He left behind a wife of 27 years and his two daughters. His widow speaking out during a press conference on the year anniversary of his death. Henry was killed. But what that in effect did was it killed the whole family, not just this family, but the business family, the immediate family. I reached out to Lozano's family for this report, but they declined to revisit his case. Even though the case has gone, uh, gone on for so long, I, mean, I, I still think somebody out there knows something. Detective Edward Alvarado with the Corpus Christi Police Department has spent all these years waiting for clues. Leads have come in over the last couple of years, and it may be one lead a year, two leads a year. Um, I still consider it active. Witnesses describe the suspect as a white man. They say he pulled up next to Lozano's truck at the intersection, opened fire, and sped away in a white four-door Chevy Corsica. But as time went on, there was never an arrest, never a motive. The case going cold. Unfortunately, um, the evidence, we just don't have enough evidence to charge a person or persons with this crime. There's people out there that may know something about the case. Lieutenant Mark Tooley with the Robbery Homicide Division of CCPD tells me the biggest challenge in solving cases like this one is always getting people to come forward and talk. Time's gone by and relationships change and uh, maybe they're ready to come forward and talk to us about it and getting it back out in the public eye uh, may remind them. Hopefully paving the way to solve this murder and bring his family some closure. Bill Churchwell, 3 News. And listen, and if you have any information that can help solve this murder, call Corpus Christi Police at 886-2600. There's also a Facebook page that is dedicated to solving this particular crime. We'll have that information on our website, kitchpolitv.com, following this newscast.